A cyber attack creating real chaos in the healthcare world. I'm Paula Eben. And I'm Lisa Hughes. So far, it's hospitals and doctors who've experienced the bulk mm -hmm. of the problems. But as WBZ's Christina Rex shows us, that could soon change. Brian Harnsberger has a therapy practice with over 600 patients, but hasn't been able to bill them properly since February. Everything was just kind of in the black. When we would go and try to submit our claims, uh, the website more or less was shut down. That's because of a cyber attack at Change Healthcare on February 21st. Change Healthcare is a service owned by United Health Group. It's a middleman for healthcare providers that manages billing and processes claims with client records for more than 85 million patients, meaning it impacts not just United Health clients, but most people on any insurance. It was impacting every single provider in the healthcare system in America. Most patients aren't even aware of this cyber attack, even though it happened nearly six weeks ago. Ago. But that doesn't mean it can't impact you. United Health Group is still analyzing just what patient data was accessed in this hack. Usually the data is limited to billing codes. Cyber expert Peter Tran says not to worry too much about your personal data. Users of healthcare portals, now that portals are open to patients, don't necessarily need to worry that the sky is falling. But patients could feel the pinch when their bills come. As providers find workarounds, often billing manually, that means your bills could stack up over the weeks the system is down. People need to financially plan for that. United has already paid some of the ransom to get some systems online. Just last year, Point32 Health, another huge company, suffered from a major cyber attack too. But why? So the larger you are, the larger you can fall, but the larger of a target that you are. For providers like Harnsberger, the inconvenience is frustrating, but a lack of communication and accountability from these big company attacks is far worse. It, it feels like providers are now a human shield for insurance companies. Uh, we are taking the brunt of the complaints. Um, they're not being passed on to the middleman. Uh, we're the ones with boots on the ground, dealing with these disruptions, trying to do what's ethical and what's right. In Wellesley, Christina Rex, WBZ News.